double take consignment shop. So guys, I am at Double Take Consignment Shop in St. Charles, Illinois. And of course, we have to look at the jewelry and the purses. So this is a cute little evening bag for 25. A little brooch, butterfly brooch. Judith Jack for 30. Let's see, is this a coach? Yeah, I thought that was a coach. For 25. Let's keep looking. Let's keep looking, see what we're gonna find. Maybe we can find something at a price point where we can resell. This is pretty. I have a similar sterling piece up on eBay right now. It has been there for a long time. And I'm only asking $10 for it, so I can't afford to buy that piece for eight. And that's not sterling. So let's keep looking. I think there's various vendors in here. Yeah, I believe so we're looking for the unique and the affordable and the resellable, but is that ever cute? All right, let's see what this says. Timmy Woods, made in the Philippines. That is unique. Can I get it closed again? Huh. I swear I didn't put anything in the way. <laughs> How much they want for this little beauty? Oh my god. $200. Okay. That's adorable and it's beautiful. But I don't know that I can resell it. So. As cute as it is, it will stay on the shelf. We have a Dooney and Burke bag for a hundred. Let's keep looking. So guys, if you're ever in St. Charles, come and take a look at the shop. They have a lot of lovely items that are at a great price point if you're purchasing for yourself. I, however, am looking for things I can resell. So that that puts a little bit of a different spin on my search. But you never know, it's always worth looking because you can sometimes find, like I'd love, love, love this necklace for 12. I love the natural stones. I love the beads. I just don't know that I can. I know on my channel, I'm not asking enough to make it worth purchasing that. The little cream coach for 60. But if I were purchasing for myself, I would snatch that up. I wouldn't even give it a second thought. I would buy that in a heartbeat for me we have a cute little Vera Bradley and again I'm not usually buying Vera Bradley for resale but I love it for myself just love it they're easy to keep clean let's see what we have here 18 There's got to be a little sale table here somewhere, and I may have just found it. So these are cute, but I don't know how much they are. 
Everything's got a little red cross out. Oh, that's too bad. That's missing stones. What do we have here? There's no prices. So I don't understand. There's no prices. These are cute. Yeah, I don't know what the little red scratch out means. I'm going to ask. So far, I'm going to ask about these two pieces. What's this one? I love this one. And this one. All the stones are there. That's a vintage piece. It's beautiful. What are these? Cufflinks. I don't usually sell men's items, so I don't know. It's pretty, no price. Oh, I like that. Yeah, it has a stone. It's just not as sparkly as the rest of it. It's a brooch. All right, what do we have here? Okay, this is, yeah, just not sparkly there. was 10. I'm going to pass on that one. It's just not in great shape. I have a lot of enamel earrings right now I'm trying to sell. So I'm going to pass on that. That's pretty, but it doesn't really wow me. Earrings, screw back. I gotta find out what the prices on these are. Okay, so I'm leaving this one because it's missing stones. I'm gonna leave that one. I like, oh, excuse me. I like these because they're all, I think they're all vintage. I like those. Let's see what else they have on this table. Well, these are regular price. Maybe what's inside here is not. That's a little Vera Bradley notepad. Notebook. Okay. All right, let's keep looking. So I thought that was a cute purse with the um, needlework. I'm not going to buy it because it's $35. But I thought I'd share it just because it's so pretty. And who doesn't want to spend their day looking at pretty things, right? I know I like to, I mean, that's kind of what shopping really is, right? <laughs> You're spending the day looking at pretty, pretty things. Okay, I don't see any more jewelry that's been marked down. This is all closed. So let's go find out what that jewelry is going to cost me because there's no price and it looks like it's on sale. So guys, I am picking all this up. They are $3.99 a piece. So I feel like I scored a bargain today. And if you guys like this video and you want to see more like it, please hit the subscribe button and give me a like. And I will see you soon. Bye-bye.